Hello, and welcome to the Office of Group Benefits webinar on the Bariatric Surgery Benefit. The Office of Group Benefits is adding a bariatric surgery benefit for active and retired state employees effective August 1, 2021. No more than 300 surgeries will be approved per year, and no bariatric surgeries will be performed prior to January 1, 2022. The criteria for the bariatric surgery benefit is as follows. The plan participant is required to have a body mass index, or BMI, equal to or greater than 40, or have a BMI equal to or greater than 35, and at least two qualified comorbidities. Those include, but are not limited to, hypertension, cardiopulmonary conditions, sleep apnea, diabetes, or severe osteoarthritis. This benefit is only available to state employees or retired state employees who have been enrolled in an OGB self-funded health plan, this is the Blue Cross and Blue Shield plans, with coverage in effect for at least one year. Please note that the Pelican HSA 775 plan is excluded from this benefit. If a member is enrolled in the HSA plan and meets the eligibility requirements, they must switch to another self-funded plan during the annual enrollment period to qualify for the benefit. The plan participant is required to complete no less than a five-month preoperative waiting period for 2021 and a four-month preoperative period for 2022 and beyond, which includes, but is not limited to, nutritional counseling, psychological assessment, and other testing and evaluations necessary to ensure the appropriateness of bariatric surgery. The types of surgeries that are covered are as follows gastric bypass surgery, sleeve gastectomy, duodenal switch, single anastomous duodeno ileostomy with sleeve, and other methods recognized by the American Society for Mer Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery as effective for the long-term reversal of severe obesity. There are a few limitations and exclusions that you need to be aware of. There is a lifetime limitation of one bariatric procedure per member. However, there is an exception for medically necessary revisions. A member who obtained a bariatric surgery pursuant to the Heads Up program is not excluded from participation in this program. Dependent coverage is only available if the dependent is a state employee or retiree that meets the other requirements for participation. Regardless of claim of medical necessity, benefits for fat or skin removal surgery or similar services are excluded. Additionally, regardless of claim of medical necessity, benefits for prescriptions or supplements intended for weight management or nutrition after the bariatric surgery are excluded. And again, please remember that the Pelican HSA 775 plan is excluded from this benefit. If a member enrolled in the HSA plan meets the eligibility requirements, they must switch to another self-funded plan during the annual enrollment period to qualify for this benefit. For members who have not been approved for bariatric surgery benefit, regardless of claim of medical necessity, benefits are excluded for services, surgery, supplies, treatment, or expenses related to weight loss programs, whether for medical reasons or under medical supervision, and any bariatric surgery, whether for obesity or morbid obesity, except as required by law. There is a planned participant cost share associated with the bariatric surgery benefit. For pre- and post-operative services, there is a 20% coinsurance. And for surgery, a $2,500 facility copay and 10% coinsurance for the surgery. Please note that the plan participants' copayments and or coinsurance for the bariatric surgery benefit do not accumulate toward the plan member's deductible amount or out-of-pocket amount. So let's go over some approved facilities in the state of Louisiana. 
Services must be provided in a Blue Cross Blue Shield of Louisiana network provider facility holding the Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery Accreditation and Quality Improvement Accreditation by the American College of Surgeons and the American Society for Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery. There are 14 facilities in Louisiana that have these accreditations. You can see the parishes highlighted on the map where these facilities can be found. Those are in Caddo, Washita, Rapides, Lafayette, East Baton Rouge, Ascension, St. Tammany, Orleans, and Jefferson Parishes. The East Baton Rouge locations include the Baton Rouge General Medical Center, Blue Bonnet Campus, Our Lady of the Lake Regional Medical Center, and Woman's Hospital. For the Ascension location, you can go to the Our Lady of the Lake Ascension. Orleans and St. Tammany in locations include Oshner Medical Center in New Orleans, Oshner Medical Center North Shore in Slidell, and Our Lady of the Lake Surgical Hospital in Slidell. And the Orleans and Jefferson locations are Tulane Medical Center in New Orleans and West Jefferson Medical Center in Marrero. In Caddo Parish, you can go to the Christus Highland Medical Center or the willis Knighton Medical Center. And for Lafayette, Rapides, and Washita Parishes, Oshner Lafayette General Medical Center in Lafayette, Christus St. Francis Cabrini in Alexandria, and St. Francis Medical Center in Monroe. So how do you find an in-network bariatric surgeon? Each of the 14 accredited facilities should be able to direct you to a surgeon that is in network and operates at their facility. You can also visit www.bcbs.com slash blue dash distinction dash center slash physician to search for surgeons in Louisiana. The surgery center they are affiliated will be displayed next to their name, as you can see in the picture below. Now that you know more about the benefit and where you can go to have your bariatric surgery performed, let's talk about how you get approved to participate in the program. The benefit program is limited to 300 surgeries per calendar year. Members will visit an approved facility or a surgeon to determine their candidacy for surgery. If a surgeon or facility determines the member is a good candidate, they should submit the appropriate authorization form via fax to OGB for preoperative services. A prior authorization for preoperative services and surgery is required for all members, including those with Medicare. A member with Medicare as the primary plan and an OGB self-funded plan as the secondary plan must meet the requirements of this program, including but not limited to prior authorizations, before OGB will issue any benefits as the secondary plan. OGB will confirm eligibility and forward to Blue Cross Blue Shield Louisiana's designated utilization management department staff. The Blue Cross Blue Shield UM department determines if the member meets the clinical criteria. Approval will be sent back to the surgeon's office and OGB for list management. The surgeon's office will be responsible for notifying the member of their approval or denial status. The surgeon's office will direct the member to the various specialist labs, etc., to fulfill preoperative requirements. Once the member has completed the required preoperative services, a second authorization should be submitted to Blue Cross Blue Shield of Louisiana for surgery. Once 300 members qualify for the bariatric surgery benefit, no additional authorizations for preoperative services will be improved until either a member exits before undergoing a bariatric surgery or a new calendar year begins. Please note that a member who exits the bariatric surgery benefit program prior to receiving the bariatric surgery will be considered eligible to reapply for the program. 
After 300 members are participating, a waiting list, also on a first-come, first-served basis, will be established. This waiting list will be continued from year to year to maintain an applicant's position on the list. The waiting list will be maintained by OGB. This is the enrollment pre-authorization form. It will be available on the OGB website on Monday, August 2nd, 2021. This form should be completed by the surgeon or facility coordinator and returned by fax to OGB. OGB will only accept forms that are faxed from the provider. OGB will not accept forms that are sent in by plan members. Again, this form should be faxed to OGB at the number on the form. Please do not send by email or postal mail. If you have questions about the Bariatric Services Benefit, you can email them to ogb.bariatrics at la.gov. A member of the OGB Bariatric staff will respond to your email within 48 hours.